you know, we uh, got a couple of guys back in that are important to our structure and our team, and um, we're giving a couple of the young fellas a, a go. Who form's been pretty good all year, and we've wanted to try and get into our team. And you know, after after last Saturday night's performance, it gives us a good opportunity to do that. Carlisle and Chaplin coming in uh, certainly uh, strengthen us up. Maddie Thomas on ball, um, and Jay Schultz up forward. So yeah, look, pretty uh, four good inclusions for us, and uh, a couple of kids who are going to uh, taste the first time we play at the MCG for a while. So we continue to edu educate them. Um, the thought process of when we're getting smacked in, in games, you, uh, your mind wanders off into how, how you're going to get the next kick or uh, what's happening to us or who's going to get us out of this rut. So all, all those combinations of things factor into it and playing a pretty good team like we did last week also factor into it. We review the same as we do every Monday, just trying to break it up after a pretty heavy loss and uh, individually set some goals for the next month for the players and um, you know get them some real buy into what they want to achieve out of the next four weeks. And then when we come back Wednesday, let's get into what the team want to achieve over the next four weeks. So just to break it up for them and uh, you know, get rid of the review. It wouldn't have been a great review to watch anyway, so trying to do uh, just a little bit different for the players. As I said, we've reviewed it the same way uh, nearly every Monday, so it was just a matter of being a long season. It was a, uh, a long weekend for the boys after their performance, and uh, I was just trying to do something different when they came into the club Monday. Well, we've gone uh, backwards with our position on the ladder, um, but we've gone ahead in the development of our uh, 18 to 24-year-olds, um, the experience they've garnered from playing AFL footy. So, um, you know, we'd still like to have won a lot more games than what we have, and uh, in the that's what you judge on and that's what everyone reviews your season at so uh, you know in that regard we've gone backwards but in what we've been able to develop in our group um, oh, I think we've gone forward. We, we, we thought our ability to contest it was always going to be one of our strengths and um, you know we probably didn't focus on it heavily in pre-season we focused on a few other things and maybe that's why it's popped up uh, we've missed a couple of key plays in that area for periods of the year um, and then we've got on a bit of a streak of not winning games which impacts on the, the, the players mentality of that also so there's a few combinations but it's still really disappointing to be where we're at and um, you know, while we can say we're going to have a big pre-season and get ready for it next year, we've still got four games to make sure we uh, hold ourselves in good stead. And the big lessons is uh, well, what we needed to do, we've had to do, we definitely had to do it and uh, there's no way going about it and uh, a few of our results have been because of that but some of them have been um, uh, still an unacceptable level of what it takes to play AFL footy. So you know, I said when I got the job that I wanted to play a core group of players and get them playing a lot of footy together and we have done that so um, you know, that was either going to take us a step forward or a step backwards but in the long run of things, it's always going to take us a step forward. Oh yeah, look, I suppose there are a few players playing for um, to keep themselves on our list, but uh, you know, I'm not going into the names of it all. But you know, Stephen's pretty uh, crucial to how we want to play, and we know what Jake is capable of. He just hasn't been allowed to do that this year. Oh, uh, well, Butch can compete. That's what we do know about him. So we want to see him compete in the air and on the ground, and. Um, um, hopefully we can get the ball inside 50 to give him a, a decent ample opportunity to impact on the scoreboard. But I just want to see Butch uh, do what he does best and that's compete in the air and on the ground. And uh, if he can do that, um, he'll hold himself in good stead to play the last month with us.